Hi everyone! In this video I will show you how to connect Canon iSenses LBP673 CDW to your Android smartphone and start using it. First you need to connect the printer to your Wi-Fi network. To do this stay on the home screen and use the navigation arrows to select menu, press OK. Uh, now go to preferences, switch to network and make sure the wireless connection is enabled. So select the first option here, press OK switch to wireless, press OK, settings applied, one more time OK and stay in the network menu and now select wireless LAN settings. It's searching for the routers nearby. You need to select your Wi-Fi network from this list. This printer can connect to 2.4 GHz networks only. Uh, so press OK, OK one more time and on this screen you need to enter your password. Uh, use this numeric keyboard just like on cell phones when typing SMS to switch between small and uh, capital letters go to entry mode and also you can select digits here and to select symbols go to symbols. Go back. Uh, if you need backspace this is this uh, C letter. So uh, enter your Wi-Fi password and press the right arrow each time after after each letter and once you're done select apply and press ok switch to yes press ok and now it's connecting that's it now you can press home to go to the home screen to finish setting up on your Android smartphone, open Google Play Store and install the application called Canon Print, uh, then open it, wait for a while, uh, agree to the license agreement. These options are optional, so you can decline all of them or check all, it's up to you. Uh, next, these permissions are necessary and you have to give it to the application. So press OK, allow to access to the device's location while using the app and allow to connect to nearby devices. Allow. Next on this screen, also you can allow to send your notifications. This is not necessary, but it will be bothering you. Please, please allow. So let's just allow right away. And on the home screen, tap on add slash switch tap on register printer and make sure your smartphone is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your printer. You can use 5 GHz band as well, the point is to be connected to the same Wi-Fi router. So your printer is appeared here and tap on its model name. Just wait for a while. Now your printer is added to the system and you can print right from this application or use smartphone copy feature, just take pictures of your documents to convert them to scans and print right away. Uh, but let me show you how it works on Android devices. You can print any file from your system now. Let's, let's go to my files, uh, select a PDF file we wish to print, let's say this one. And now uh, this icon appears here, open in Canon print, so you can open in this application. Do you want to use the following printer? Yes, this is our printer. Uh, check your preview, you can use these arrows to switch between pages and tap on next. Now tap on this area to adjust your printing settings. Output method is print, of course. Uh, select output size, if the paper size is not selected automatically. Uh, set number of copies, print range, which pages do you wish to print from this document. Just all of them on, or only some range from one, from first to second, for example. A paper source, I recommend you to set to auto, especially if you correctly set up uh, the paper in your printer. Uh, select color or black and white mode, uh, select two-sided printing on long, long or short edge. Uh, by the way, this printer can print on both sides automatically. Page layout, one-on-one -on -one or two-on-one -on -one in this case. Uh, PDF preview method. So uh, you don't need to use this feature for normal printing. And let's go back. Now you can see preview, it will be printed like this. 
and just tap on print your document will be printed also you can print from any application that allows you to print you then don't have to use canon print each time you can print email for example go to any letter you wish to print out and tap on these three dots at the top select print all make sure your printer is selected in this drop down then adjust your settings and tap on print back to the canon print application you can tap on your printer's icon on the home screen and access the remote ui feature go to printer settings and see online manual so explore this application it's very useful and handy and that's how it works that's pretty it guys i hope this was helpful if yes consider to subscribe to our channel hit the like button and be awesome bye